In problem number 13 of section 2.4, we use the fundamental theorem of calculus to evaluate the integral from 0 to 1 of 2x plus 6 times e to the x plus 3 quantity squared. Now, what we should notice right away is um, that the derivative of the um, x plus 3 squared, which is you know, up here in the e term, is actually just repeated here. And that's always a good clue to use uh, substitution. So if we let u equal um, x plus 3 squared, well then du will equal 2 times x plus 3 dx. Uh, of course, we can just rewrite this as 2x plus 6 dx. And now we can rewrite the original integral as the integral of uh, e to the u. And here we have 2x plus 6 dx, which is equal to du. So this whole complicated integrand actually just reduces it down to something pretty simple if we make the right, right choice of substitution to change variables. Uh, the last step is to change the limits of integration. So here we're integrating from x equals 0 to x equals 1, and we want to change that to u equals something to u equals something. So if x is equal to 0, then u is equal to 3 squared. So the lower limit will be 9. And similarly, if x is equal to 1, then u is equal to 1 plus 3 squared, or 16. Now, we can evaluate this, and the integral, uh, indefinite integral of um, e to the u, is, or excuse me, antiderivative of e to the u is just e to the u. And we'll evaluate this from 9 to 16. And so this is e to the 16th minus e to the 9th. 